Love is messy. Our love is no exception. Part of our love includes happy times, but our love is more built on the messy times, times when we needed God the most. But in these times, when our relationship has been its messiest and most inconvenient, I have still thought that you, Abigail, are worth fighting for. And I'm reminded that the ultimate example of love is who I vow to have as the foundation of our marriage. From the time he was born in a messy barn to the time he took on the weight of our messy sins, Jesus showed that his kind of love is the one kind of love that can make marriages work. And I vow, with the best of my human ability, to show this love to you each and every day. Because this love is patient, so I vow to be patient with you. And this love is kind, so I vow to be kind to you. And this love does not envy, and it does not boast, and it is not proud, so I vow to be selfless with you. And this love keeps no records of wrong, so I vow to be forgiving. And this love tells the truth, so I vow to be honest. And this love protects and hopes, so I vow to be your protector and your comforter. And finally, this love always perseveres. So Abigail, in front of God and all our friends and family, I vow to fight for our marriage till death do us part. Jacob, today I stand before you as an eager bride, vowing to give my life to you. After nearly four years, the Lord has led us to this very moment and prepared us for this lifelong commitment. I know you are God's perfect provision for me. In front of our family and friends, I vow today and every day after to serve you, honor you, and cherish you wholeheartedly. I vow to be your biggest fan and cheerleader and fight for every single one of your dreams. I vow to make every day filled with joy and to make you smile and laugh relentlessly. I vow to celebrate your joys and to comfort your sorrows. I can't promise that I can fix all of our problems, but I can vow that you will never have to go through anything alone ever again. I vow to respect you as a leader of our family. You have led me toward Jesus every single day and I am so thankful for your guidance. I vow to put you before me and we before I. I vow to be patient, kind, and deliberate with my love. I vow to continually pursue you and never give up on our love, no matter our age. I thank God every day for the beautiful life you have already given me. You have filled every inch of my heart with so many blessings. You have changed my life in so many ways. I am a new person because of you, and I am a better person because of you. Jacob, I have loved you with everything in my soul, even from the beginning. I love you more on this day, and I will love you even more tomorrow. It is a blessing to have even met you, and I am honored to be your wife. I present to you now, for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jacob Hamilton Dunn. Marriage is a partnership of two unique people who bring out the very best in each other and who know that even though they're wonderful as individuals, they are even better together. committing to each other that we are better together 